Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. How are you guys doing? I hope it's a beautiful day wherever in the world you are today. Um, today we are in my kitchen. I'm not cooking guys. Um, I just thought I would do a food haul, more like a food shop haul, um, and some meal planning. Um, and I just wanted to show you guys how I'm going to do that. Um, I haven't actually been one to always meal plan, you know, and plan my week ahead, honestly. I'm the worst person ever. <laughs> um, but recently, we've been eating so many takeouts due to the fact that I'm pregnant. I've not really been cooking. And by the time I get back from work, I'm so tired. My husband isn't much of a cooker. He'll rather do anything else you ask him to do but cooking just as an thing. And that's cool. Um, but yeah, we've just been suffering a lot like with food recently. So I thought it's high time I try as much as I can to nip that in the bud. Um, I have meal planned in the past and to be honest, it's turned out to be so much cheaper. We tend to eat so much healthier as well. So why not? Um, it can be a struggle, you know, if you're a working mom and you work outside the home or inside the home and you're constantly just thinking, well, what are we going to eat? What are we going to eat? I spend half of my life thinking about that because I never plan. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm about to change my ways. I want to do something about that um, and that's why we are meal planning today if it's your first time watching me thanks for tuning in my name is Biola aka Mama Libby and on this channel I love to share my journey through motherhood I am a mum of one and I also have another one on the way um, and if you're one of my old subscribers, thank you so much for coming back. I really appreciate you. Don't forget to hit that like button. Don't forget to comment and please share this video as well. Okay, so I'm going to get straight into it. As it is the end of the month, we're pretty much out of most things in this house. Um, so what I'm going to do first of all is just go through all the cupboards, just see what we have and what we need. And then I'll do my meal planning based on that. So I've managed to come up with my shopping list after going through all my cupboards and I've also taken a mental note of things that we do have in the house. Um, that just gives me an idea of the kind of meals that I can make and I've then gone ahead to make a meal plan. <laughs> So it's been a couple of hours since I last spoke to you guys. Um, I've been to church, just got back um, and I had to go do some food shopping as well. So I'm home now with all my food shopping and I'm just going to show you guys um, some of the stuff that I have bought for the week. Um, I have already started cooking um, just to make my life easier. It's a Sunday evening, work starts tomorrow. So I'll start over here where I've got all my fruit and veg. So I've got some pears, grapes, bananas, um, some sweet crumbs, which we really like. I'm always reaching for those. I've got a watermelon. I've got this sweet leaf carrot salad, um, which is what I'm going to use for my chicken wraps. I've also got some spinach here. Um, normally I use these to make a smoothie. Um, I like to have like a green smoothie every other day. I'll combine my grapes and spinach um, and some milk or something um, just so I know that I'm getting some goodness in me and baby's getting some goodness as well. And Olivia likes to drink this as well. I've also got here some mixed vegetables. We'll be using those in a couple of dishes as well. I've got this um, carrot batons, which is more like a snack. We'll be having that as a snack, and they'll probably also go in maybe my pasta salad or something. Um, I've also had to buy some sunflower oil, as we were completely out of it. And then over here, I have got some tuna chunks, which I'm going to use in my pasta salad. Um, I've got some sweet corn. Again, that will be used in my pasta salad. I've got some lasagna sauce. 
um, and some cheese these will go together um, for my lasagna I've also got some cookies some hobnobs digestives we love snacking in this house um, but we try to keep it to a minimum as much as we can um, normally we have this biscuit tin here and as you can see there's like three biscuits left so I had to stock up on those um, and I've just kept it really basic there I've also got these um, chocolate bombs. Olivia actually picked this up while we were at the store. Um, they're just like little treats. So we'll be having those as well. I've got some pepper pig yogurts because that's the only yogurts Livy would have right now. Um, I've also got some yogurt for myself and hubby, um, which is the Activia Intensely Creamy. I love this one. Um, I've got some pasta here. I bought two packs of pasta. I think they were actually on offer. I'm not too sure. Um, but I've got two packs of those and I've got the penne and um, the other type. I've also got some chocolate chip bread rolls here. These again are more like a snack. Um, we'll just snack on those. I've also got my wraps these are wheat white wraps and these are going to be used to make my chicken wraps and also here we've got some chicken breast which i will be seasoning and then frying to put into my um i mean not frying grilling i'll be grilling it to put into my chicken wrap with some salad and mayo i love that um and here we've just got some treats for livy these are some barneys um I've got some rolled oats as well um, even though we do have some cereal in the house because what I found is I just have little packs of cereal you know there's about four different types of cereal there um, and they're just half packs we never tend to finish them and then we're buying another one um, so I want all these finished up before I buy any more granola or sweet cereal in the house um, and that's it really what else haven't i shown you guys the only other thing i haven't shown you guys was some milk um and that's all we got really so that's all the shopping i've done for this week obviously like this could carry over into the weekend i'm not too sure it just depends on how hungry we are i guess um but yeah um and also like on top of our weekly shop we do do a once a month um african market shop where we get all our red meat chicken um tomatoes bell peppers um rice and things like that um, we buy those in bulk and those tend to last us for the month um so yeah i did that we did that yesterday um so this is just in addition this is just like the few groceries we'll need through the week and that's it guys i need to go start cooking i'm obviously not going to cook all my meals today um but i'm going to cook like you know the hard ones the ones that i can freeze um i'm going to make sure i cook those today just to make my life a bit easier and i hope you have enjoyed this video if you have don't forget to give it a big fat thumbs up don't forget to hit that subscribe button please comment down below is there any other way you meal plan any tips you have for me that could possibly make this mother's life easier please let me know down below in the comment section i'd love to hear from you thanks for watching until next time